As I said, guys, we are not done with Edible Magazine. We have wrangled Amy White, the recipe writer, to bring in a fall appetizer. So, Amy, what are we making today? Um, it's a winter squash mm -hmm. with some nice warm spices, cinnamon and coriander, and a whipped goat cheese and honey. Wow, it, it smells, smells It yeah. smells so good. So Thank walk you. us through ingredients that you have laid out here. Okay, so these are some beautiful delicata squash from Sterling Gardens I got on the farmer's market on Saturday. Okay. And then we have some... Um, Coriander, cinnamon, honey, and some uh, goat cheese from um, the old windmill dairy out in Estancia. Oh, okay. So mm -hmm. everything's local. Mm -hmm. yeah. That's great. Okay, yeah. so let's jump into it. What's the first step? Okay, so I've baked these squashes um, in the oven. A delicata is a really nice um, sweet squash, and um, it's one of the as the summer as the um, summer comes to the end, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. the squashes are. You know, coming into the market, and delicata is one of the ones that it's not a long keeper. You would want to eat that first. Okay. You know, so cool. if you're stocking up on big winter squashes Start at the market, with this one. Start yeah. Eating this so one. eat okay. those first. Okay. Eat How the long did you bake it for? And then um, I baked it for about half an hour. Okay. And um, we're gonna s just sprinkle it with some cinnamon and Great. coriander, and then top it with the whipped goat cheese. Now, is the first thing you do? You cut this open, and then. I'm assuming there's seeds in here. Yes. Okay. Yes. And then you you de-seed it. Yeah. So okay. let's cut one open to see okay. in, in the um, so inside. So we can see what we're working with. Yeah. Okay. And when you're looking for a a winter squash, um, the delicata, you want to kind of um, you want to look for it has just a little bit of um, this orange tinge to it okay. in the. Um, you know, it needs to be a nice golden yellow color. Okay. Golden yellow color. Yeah, okay. and have little orange tinges to it. There's mm -hmm. other, you know, techniques for knowing what, um, at what point other squashes are riper. And, you know, all squashes will actually um, get sweeter in storage. Okay. Really? Okay, that's yeah. good to know. Yeah, that's yeah that's they, know. their sugars develop more, um, and there's a limit to it, though. You know, some squashes, certain squashes don't keep as long. This is not a long keeper. Okay. The ones that keep the longest are the butternuts, and they actually get so much sweeter in storage, you can actually keep those until spring. I mean, really? you can okay. keep okay. A, a butternut squash in the So that looks familiar. Counter. We de-seed it. Now, after Six we months. bake it, then we just start throwing spices on it? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, so after we throw these spices, do we bake it again, or is it just done after that? It's just done. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Great. So this is a really nice, simple dish. Great. Well, we're gonna put we're gonna put all the finishing touches on this with okay. Amy. Guys, stay with us. We'll be right back.